also getting on very well in the number one AC Cobra. Nicholas Minassia taking things a little more steady. There is Alex Brundle. All of them getting a feel for how much grip. Look how slippy, slidey it is as they try and accelerate out of Madwick. Dumas was snaking all the way up this pitch straight as down the inside goes the Oliver Bryant car. He is now up into second place. Yeah, that was lovely. Oli Bryant's going for it in the AC Cobra versus another Cobra up ahead. And it's Roman Dumas that he is battling with. Dumas has the line as they go into St. Mary's. Sometimes, though, an outside line gives you more grip. Look at the steering efforts. Oh, the outside line was great. And has he got to hold on to it? He may do. Try not to go too deep. Oh, he's done it. He's in front. Just about holds it. Yeah, that traditional karting style in the wet line, wasn't it? Round the outside. So we'll have a look how far Dumas is. But it's still raining. Wipers are still going as he holds the inside there at Levant. Yeah, everybody being super cautious because that's where Trulliwe went off on the safety car lap. And we've got all oh, the, yeah, just running a little bit Jimmy wide. Johnson. Jimmy Johnson. He was saying his uh, first experience of driving a car like this, 1960s car of any sort in this conditions uh, and he had a slight off but he gathered it back so here we go Roman Dubas coming back again trying to retake that place from Ollie Bryant stunning stuff but Ollie Bryant in the number one Cobra has got the advantage at this stage they're still learning where is the grip where is it really slippery watch out so easy to make a mistake it's so easy but Dumas now can see the rear of the number one car, Volley Bryant, and he can get a taster. And there is the indicator on to the number four car, who actually, he's come quite a way back up, hasn't he? Yeah, he's done quite well, but of course he's due a pin stop, isn't he? So yeah. Benoit Trulia is coming in now to hand over to Nick Jarvis. This, this was the lead car before we went into that red flag situation, although we always thought he would be under threat. And this, of course, will drop that car right down the field. Now, Tom Christensen's lost a bit of time there. Um, he's lost a few places on that lap in the fact. In the number 17, Black Lister, and he is now going to try and get it back again. The Lister Jaguar Coupe, and right behind Alex Brundle, number 94. He's now chasing his way through.